What's up guys, uh, it's Gaming Sausage here. Um, so recently I thought, you know what, I can't just uh, just keep making gaming videos all the time, can I? So I thought, I don't know, I'll try and make something a little different, something that you don't really see every day. Um, so as you can see, probably by the title and in the video, you know, that's some paper right there. Um, so I'm pretty much going to do a little tutorial on how to draw a cool dude's face. Um, so what you're going to need is, step one, obviously some paper. Any paper will do really. And um, this is some A5 paper in a pad. Right? Uh, that's just preferences. Um, second, uh, obviously, yeah, you're going to need a pencil. I'm using here, I'm using a HB pencil. As you can see, um, I try and uh, get the focus on this uh, can't work, but it's too fiddly and I can't do it. Um, next, uh, it's probably essential, but I mean you should all really know if you've got a pencil, you don't need a sharpener. I quite like these ones, uh, so you can just keep you know sharpening them for well until this is full and then you can go empty it and carry on instead of having to always hang around a bin um, lastly um, you'll need something like a rubber um, this kind of rubber I can do or you know maybe one on the end of a pencil um, I'd be using these kinds of pencils but yeah, you know I kind of like using these ones They're quite nice to hold in my hand got a nice feel to them okay <clears throat> so let's start. Um, so what you want to start with, yeah, it's going to be some simple shapes. So we're gonna, um, we're gonna need sort of like a round ball sort of shape here. Try and keep it light. Let's get that uh, in, just so maybe I'll maybe darken it a bit, just so you can see it. Try and get a nice bit round shape. Like that. Yeah, like that. Then maybe about two sort of centimeters away from this side here. And just do that. About here. You're going to want to draw another ball of around the same size. Uh, ideally, you want it the same size, but it's quite hard to get everything perfect, you know. Okay. Keep that light as well. So now you've got your... I've got an idea. I thought having my blinds open would have been better for the video, but apparently it's harder to see everything. Okay, so now you've got your two simple ball shapes down. You want to sort of go maybe a quarter of the way in each ball and sort of just draw lines coming out of it like that I'll try and uh, sort the light out one second okay sorry about that, unfortunately there's nothing I could do about uh, the lighting but uh, we'll carry on so yeah, it was about a quarter of the way through the circle so maybe the circle could do with a little bit more there. Right, put a quarter of the way in. Right, so now what we want to do is want to sort of kind of make sort of like a tube shape that goes down to it at some point and then sort of just end it with like a line just so you know the tube's being made. This line, these lines can be a bit thicker on the side here because they're more like complete lines. Also, from where these connect to these ball shapes, you can sort of. Oh! Wasn't expecting the lead to completely snap. Might be the pencil, I'll try. Back up pencil. Just had a lot of these pencils lying around, so I thought I'd use these ones. Oh, 
Okay, looks like I'll just use this pencil here. Just sharpen that. Okay. I'm just try and thicken that round there. Don't go all the way round. Because you want to leave uh, space for the eyebrows. Nicely. Round. Try and keep it even though, remember that. Okay. So, for this I'm going to do like a whole sort of monobrow sort of thing, so I'm just going to sort of, hmm, actually maybe I'll cover part of it with some hair, so we're just going to go down the side here. Sort of indicate some sort of hair that connects up to there. I'll thicken it just so you can kind of see the idea I'm trying to get at here. Now, sort of from there, it gives you the idea of sort of where the hair should go, so sort of. Trying to keep it sort of even, like kind of a V ish shape, so like the longest part's like in the middle. Okay, so this side, we're just gonna sort of carry and try and copy what we did on the other side. Okay, that's good. Now we're just gonna try and this can be a little bit more rough. So just get that up there, nice. I'm just kind of shade that in just a little bit, just to indicate, you know, that that's going to be darker than the rest. Before we get nearer the end. Right. So now we need a mouth. Yeah, um, a good thing to do is sort of maybe come from this line that we drew here. Come off and make sort of like a a bell shape or a, a sort of like a bit of a dodgy looking D. Sort of like that. Try and get it nice and dark. Right. So see on this long sort of pipe shape gonna wanna try and just I'm gonna make them look like a bit stressed or a bit angry so I'm just gonna give them a little bit of a sort of a stress mark right there maybe another one here like that as you can see so over here I'm just gonna sort of go over that shape just a little bit like that. Right, and then come down here and just to get a little sort of effect of like and being angry you want to sort of draw a line in from here. Like that and sort of connect that round. Just kind of darken it up a bit. Try and like get a sort of bell shaped round here. Okay. okay, so now that we can just go back to the hair and we can just sort of go over it now. Now that we've got the initial ideas of where the hair was going to go, can okay, just be a lot more sketchy about it. As you can see. In fact, I'm kind of going to have the hair go over the eyes completely, so you can't actually see the pupils, so... Like that. Nice, we're just going to have it 
over a little bit from the bottom now. Yep, I'm trying to overlap it at the bottom here. It kind of looks like you can't see anything. Like that. There you go. So that's uh, how to draw um, a cool dude's face. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, please, if you ever, if you actually do this, uh, please uh, don't hesitate to post maybe a link in the comment section of your uh, finished drawing. Uh, it would be much appreciated. Uh, it would be nice to see people uh, using my tutorial to draw some uh, cool guys' faces. Um, put the pencil down there. And thanks for watching.